Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Dude. Somebody wants some attention. He, yeah, he acts like he doesn't get it. He wants attention for five minutes and then he's going to watch. Yeah, yeah that's, not, that's same with my dog, same way. When my dog does, he sits next to me and goes, <sighs> and breathes all deep, like he's, you know, getting my attention by doing that. He does. <laughs> Just imagine being an animal like that. And all you gotta do all day long is play. And eat yeah. and sleep and right, play. Yeah, because of us. And play and eat and sleep and play. Normally you'd be killing. And lick your ass. This ain't playing. <laughs> you ain't tough, you did. What up? What up? You all did. My shit. Same shit, different day. Different day. Pretty much. Excuse me, little one. Can I have my spot? Oh, I'm going to sit down anyway and watch you jump. <laughs> there you go. I'm going to have to flip tomorrow. Huh? You can't have that flip. Yeah. Uh, you're doing the flip open. Yeah. See how it goes. Last year I shot the worst round I've ever shot. So. Well, try three minutes of meditation before you round. Two yeah. minutes of meditation afterwards and forgive yourself for being fucking absent minded and crazy minded. Because right. you're <laughs> human. Yeah. I think it will be helpful having this. Stay the night there. Kind of. True, but you're also going to be sleeping in a fucking tent, so. Sleeping in a tent and getting up playing disc golf and not being able to take a shower, eat a fucking meal, do all that shit. So there's going to be. Give and take. (laughs) Yeah, and it's not your last tournament. Right. Keep that in your fucking head, too. That's the way I remember. Yeah, that's one thing I know you do, because everyone does as human, is to kind of like. Oh my God! So I gotta get to it's. Right. It's not your last opportunity. You're right. gonna play in 20 more tournaments right. this year alone. For sure. And you're only 28, 29. Yeah, I turned 30 in November. 30 in November. Oh my goodness. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't remember 30. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you can't. Right? I can't remember 30. That's too much weed for that. Right. Way right, too folks. much. Take yeah, it easy. easy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Have fun up there. Oh, yeah. Yup. What? Man. What? I uh, drove down eight mile from from uh, Evergreen all the way to Gratiot. Yeah, from Evergreen all the way to Gratiot, and every dispensary that I passed every dispensary that I passed it was um, every parking lot was like I'm talking about jam packed with cars Hmm. jam packed you hear what I'm saying yeah every one of them yeah they are knocking it down man I mean come on dude you see what I'm going through I know that's what I'm saying they said that they've already made They've already collected over sixteen million dollars in taxes on marijuana already this year. Mm-hmm. Damn. Yeah, well, at least the, the states and the cities are getting something out of it. Maybe if they use it properly. Uh, well, I mean, they're getting something. They're gonna build bombs with it, or they're gonna build hospitals. I don't know. That's what we need to figure out. How we can get our actual will. Because right now, the will of the minority are the ones that control the fucking money. Well, you know, people keep doing what they're doing. People have to get together in large groups and make these motherfuckers change. Just like they're doing right now. And all these marshals with, th- with hundreds of thousands of people, not just thousands. Man, I've never seen marches like this in my life. Even back during the Civil Rights, there were never marches like this. Really? Oh, Trump is going to get an ass whooping into the next election. It's not even going to be close by any stretch of the imagination. It's not going to even be close. To. You keep saying that. By 10 or 11 o'clock at night, we're going to know who the president is. Yeah, and I think it's going to be Trump. No. No, there's no fucking way, dude. It is no. 
It is absolutely no way. It's really about that no way, huh? It's not enough for his people. Okay. As simple as that. It's not enough for them. It doesn't have to be. It's not enough for them in the proper places. Yes, there is. If he picks Gretchen, not this time. Michigan. It's going to be even even more people going to turn out to vote Democratic. If he picks her, it's going to be a landslide. I don't know about that. Oh, yeah. If he picks her, I think it's... It's going to be a landslide. The window almost killed me. Death by window? Something. Oh. No, that motherfucker don't stand a chance. Yes. But after that stunt, after that stunt, yep, yesterday, didn't forget whenever that stunt was. When he fucking tear Stood in front of the church. Protesters for no reason. And then what, stood in front of the church with the Bible? Yeah. Oh, he pissed a lot of people. Yeah, but the, they're doing a good job of making looking like these things are violent. No, they're not. Yes, they are. Mm -mm. See, a lot of these police commissioners got got hip to that shit, and they're separating the troublemakers from the innocent people. In Detroit, they did a hell of a job. They got 127 of them. And they check their names and their, their drivers like they're from other states. You know what I mean? Troublemakers. Found them with railroad spikes. They were throwing at the police. Oh yeah. They pick these motherfuckers out, man. Yeah. Then a lot of the protesters were turning them in, pointing out the ones that were doing it, you know what I mean? And that's what we need. We need groups of people working together against the evil. Evil McNeevil. The evil McNeevil? Mm hmm. What? I'm telling you, man, I've seen a lot of marches in my day. I'm. I and I've never know. seen anything like this. The only thing that comes even close to this, and this is way more than that, the Million Man March, but this is way more than a million people. Way more. And it's going on in Europe. It's not just here. It's in England. It's in Australia. It's all over the world, man. People are, are you know, marching. and It's really difficult because... It's, I don't know, I feel, it's one of those things where you, I feel like I'm at a point where I just let whatever happen happen. Well, when needed, call on me. Until then, I'm well, just going to stand aside and let you do what you want. Yeah, well, that's, that's, a, as long as you don't get in the way, well, I'm not gonna that's okay. Press, but at the same time, I'm not going to let the oppressors, or let the press become the oppressors. Even if it is against the oppressors that we're oppressing. You can't have, you can't switch, you can't go from one to the other from one minority controlling another minority. Because right now, we can both agree that it's a minority of white people that control this world. Country. Yes. Me and we all the most that. white people that you know have no control over anything, no, no say in the police, no. no say in anything to do with the world. No. They're just the same. That's why they're marching. But because they, they did vote for Trump once. Some did. They voted for Obama twice and Trump once. Some did. Yeah, I didn't vote for Enough that. of them did. Oh no, if, you know it's just like I had this discussion with some other white. I, know, I gotta friends. take it personally. I'm not taking it personally. Right. It, you know, because me and Justin we, are trying to. Yeah, we as black people, we know who's good and who's bad. We do. We know. It's it, it's easy to tell once you talk to a guy where he really is. I understand that, but that's the same words that the racists use. Mm -mm. Yeah, it is. I know. I lived. See, that's the difference between me and you is I live with the fucking races. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I know, I do too. You know what I'm saying? And they, that's how they talk. Oh, I don't mean him. He's I know. a good black guy. I know. I, I've had white guys say that to me, and I knew that, oh, this guy has a different thing going on up here. Believe me. <coughs> no, no, what I mean <coughs> is... <coughs> oh, boy, oh, my, boy. What I was trying to get Justin to understand is he, every time people talk, it's... You have Martin Luther King was trying to be potly. Like he didn't come negative. He tried to be because there's two different ways to go at it. You can go you're, you're a fucker, or you can go why are you a fucker? <coughs> why are you a fucker? What do you mean a fucker? What do you mean? Like okay, a racist, a dickhead, a, oh, okay. a shit face, a fuck. fuck well, because you were raised that way. No, no, I. But that's. Again, I understand that. I'm be trying to be empathetic to the situation that, hey, if you try to push people 
in a negative way, no matter even if your cause is good, because the cause is amazing. Everyone should be equal. I agree with this on every single okay. level. Every right. human should be. We shouldn't look at people as color. I don't understand the difference between a black person and a white person. Every human has value. That's, not, that's yes. how I like to look at it. Every human has value. Every human has value. No matter who you are, no right. matter where you are. And not everyone, because if you're born and it's back to oh, you have you have the tools to get out of that situation. No, you don't. You don't. You think you do. You think because people have the internet that they can get out of anything they want. But again, if you're raised in a family that doesn't believe in computers, how are you going to learn on the internet? Oh, go to a foot. It's the same fucking thing they're doing to the people who are they're talking about now. I understand where you're coming from because when you're young, you have no control of, of, over your environment. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like when I was younger and when I first discovered this, marijuana. And I became an advocate immediately because I immediately knew this was something good for humanity. Right. But I was, I was beat down. I was talked about. I was shunned. Seriously. Yeah. I trust me. I know. You know. My and my family uh, doesn't talk. My dad has completely cut me out of the fucking family because I grow cannabis. And this was ten years ago. This isn't fucking nineteen sixties. And see, that's the problem with a lot of people. They. Don't get the information. Mm -hmm. I'll use that as, a, as an example. Yeah. They, they, they listen to a couple of newscasts or whoever they think <laughs> is their leader, <laughs> but they, they don't try to get the information for themselves. <coughs> and if you've never done it, then you're really hard. That's the problem. Trying to get the information for yourself isn't as simple as it is. It's harder now than it was back in the yeah, day. Yeah, because back in the day, it, people didn't like to you. There was only one fucking way. Yeah, and you didn't get only one source. Now you have a hundred sources. And again, how do I know which is true and what's not? You lit people literally just say, "Well, this is how many black people die at this point." This is why. And I'm supposed to figure out that out. How am I supposed to black? Just fact check that in the same way how am I supposed to fact check how many white people died and you shouldn't have to fact check anything no you shouldn't there should be a reliable source that tells us hey this is what the cops are doing this is how many people they kill in a year this is the cops we put away and this is the cops that are being rehabilitated see we've ne see we've never had a news source that wasn't played and what I'm saying is this even before all of this fake news stuff back in the 60s, in the 70s, a lot of the news people, especially the anchors, they were ex-CIA ex people. They were in the CIA before they became a, a newscaster. So they carry that, they carrying that flag the whole time. You know, so propaganda, things are slanted. Things have always been slanted. I mean, the winner always slants it in their view. This and the, this is, and I think one of the issues that we got to stem back to is the fact that the winners of the Civil War didn't slant the world in their view. The winners of the Civil War got killed. When Ray, when because you know Lincoln got elected because he had a Southern, uh, like a Southern um, Republican, a Southern he, the the Vice President was a Southern Republican, so he was. So Lincoln dies. The South just put their people in power. They never took the people out of power that were in power. And they never, and they, they never finished the treaties that they had made. Yes, they were supposed to like banish all these them. fucking people from fucking but, power. They were never supposed to be around again. Exactly. And yet they stayed in power, mm -hmm. and they never left. And and it might not have been slavery, but they still had reign over black people. They need to go back. And open up all the books of these, every, every fucking business, private or not. And if you have any slave holdings, if you like, if you're a company that's it's never going to happen, I know it's never going to happen. But that's the only way to really solve that, it. That, that's reparations, and, and it's too many southern white uh, uh, conservatives are not going to let that happen. And you know the ironic thing is, the money is already there. The money's been there. Yeah, it's not even repar. We're not talking about reparations. No, I, I am. Get from the country, but I'm talking like go back and find out what companies now so we can actually vote with our dollar. Oh, I see what you're saying. So we can say, oh, you've literally been building your company on this systemic racism since the very beginning, since that time. I think you'd be very shocked how many companies it would be. I don't, wouldn't matter. 
I'm just <laughs> gives people a choice. It yeah, gives it people a voice. It does. Right now we don't have a voice because you have no idea. Taco Bell, Wendy's, because they're all owned by the same corporation. Mm-hmm. That corporation just mm-hmm. donated to Trump's re-election. It, of course he did. Bye bye, dude. I love Taco Bell. I fucking love it. It's my favorite fast food there is on the planet. And now I don't feel like I'm yeah, you, yeah, you don't feel you're not gonna go there as much, probably. I'm probably not gonna go there again. Yeah, not until good. this whole election's over. Yeah, I, I'm with you. Because it makes sense for them to support a Republican. Of course it does. But your base of people that eat your food hate the fucking guy. You just fucking support him. Yeah, you're, you're, you're money makers. Mm-hmm. I have a different slant on it than he does, than that corporation does. But again, it's a capitalist society, and that's what it's all about. I keep telling you, in a capitalist society, you have to have haves and have-nots, or it won't work. It won't work for the haves. It won't work. Period. Yes, it will. No. It works in fucking Sweden. A capital. It, that's not a total capitalist society. It's mostly capitalist. There's been some socialism happening in it too. And neither are we totally capitalist society. Yeah, but we we, we are not anywhere close. If we were a true capitalist society, then the top businesses that have failed wouldn't get bailed out every time they fail. Man, I'm telling you. We <laughs> we socialize the losses and we privatize the gains. That's we, a comp- when they get rid of the stock market, then I'll say, okay, we're not a capitalist society anymore. Mm. So long as the stock market's no, no. here. Oh, I get it. This There's an image of capitalism, mm-hmm. so they can steal your money. Mm-hmm. But it's it's not a capitalist society for the people in the top 5%. They don't have to worry about losing money. Every dollar yeah. they spend is insured. It's not, by about any of that. it's not about any of that to them. They've got all kinds of... Insurances. That's what I'm saying. But the forward. government is the one that's insuring it on most of these things. No, is it the government? Yes. No. Who bailed out the? What do you think that? Why everyone's pissed about that trillion dollars? What I'm seeing is the problem is that we have a government with good people and bad people in it. We know. Okay, let me let me give you how I feel. All right. We have a government. That is the exact same thing as a WWE. There's not, there may be a few good people in the House of Representatives and in local governments. Yeah, when, sure they are. But when it comes to the Senate, in my mind, now this is all in my mind. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm listening to you. In the Senate, and 90 percent of the House of Representatives are people that come from the same fucking families that have been there for generations. Yes. They don't live in the same world. That's the old money. Yeah, and they keep socializing old money. If you're someone from the old money class, you don't have to pay the fees. You don't have to do the shit that everyone else has to do. Regulations don't matter to you because why? Believe me, there's going to be a revolution in this country. And I hope so. Oh, it is going to be. It, it's happening now. It's starting now. Oh. There's going to be a revolution in this country. That's gonna be. Oh, un- I got you a new box. Unbelievable! Oh, hello. Oh Lord. Uh oh. Oh oh. Look look look. Uh oh. What is it? Oh, this is the deal. Yeah. Loud now. I wonder if they had a charge. They probably do. <laughs> what? You want it? Look at that. Whoa. War wound. What happened? So he was, they were out in their play thing and the dog came out next door. Now MJ's not out, so this dog's not really doing much at first, but they're like freaking out. Yeah, and the yeah, dog's yeah. like, I want to play with you. I was like, can't nap in there. Oh, no shit. Oh, they're going to go nuts on that. <laughs> yeah, it needs to charge. Mm. You probably have to put it in. Can I uh, wow. be one of you guys' cats? <laughs> I'll stay here and go meow, jump up in the bed. Because <laughs> they're living the life, ain't they? What's wrong with you? He says, I'm living the life. Come on, give me what I want. So, I think that Ozzy has an extra kitten. Little furry thing, white. Does he? Uh-huh. I'm tempted. Cute little furry thing. I'm tempted. They got tails. They do? Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
and the regular cats. I'm tempted, but I'm not sure yet. They look like those. They look like they're gonna be the miniature ones, you know, with the with the round fur. Or like you know yeah. what I'm talking about? The yeah, round they, heads. Like the other ones. Like a helmet on, yeah. Yeah. You're cute. You're probably gonna have to put that in the Oh uh, yeah, there you go. He's no interested in this thing no more. Uh-huh. You know something like something going on. Look at him. You really I know this for you already? Jeez, he, guy. Look at him. He, he's like, yeah, hey, come on. Where's the other one? <laughs> in the bag still. <coughs> Here, Just toss here. that one on the ground. I was going to say, just let them play with it. <laughs> I'm glad they're so big. I thought they'd be really small and I was going to be bummed. Wow. Well, he is so you. spoiled. He is spoiled. Yeah. Yeah. He's so spoiled. You would think we didn't love him. The beautiful looking animal, though. It's very Egyptian like. Yeah. He's, he is. Not her, though. <laughs> Go yeah, right. yeah, you're right. Wait till it's flopping on him. Does that, that got the cat in the it? Yeah, it does. Did you open it up? No. Oh, yeah, she didn't open up the catnip. Well, okay. You can smell it already. Yeah. Look at him, he's on it, man. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, right. yeah, 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 he's on the catnip. Yep. He needed that. On the nippy nip. He eat something. He on the nippy nip. Give me this fish. Good. <laughs> I'm gonna keep this with their toys on. He's gonna fuck that thing up quick. All right. Good. Good lord. Yeah, your uh, phone went to... What did you do this time? Stupid ad came up again. Well, what happened to the GoPro? Um, I didn't get to... I got to do... I got to figure it out. We're going to get... A, I'm going to get a computer, and I'll be able to stream it and use the phone and my GoPro at the same time. So let me show you this production get bigger and bigger and bigger. Possibly, yeah. <laughs> well, it's... And then we can stream on, like, multiple things at the same time. You know, I don't know what that means, but yeah. it, sounds, it sounds good. Yeah, like Facebook, Twitch, a oh. couple of the places. So oh, okay. More eyes. Mm. But yeah, look at him go, man. I He's know. Absolutely going ape shit for this. Oh, one. yeah. Oh, and then he got all his tubes, too. <laughs> Jesus. I thought that stuff was supposed to come to the bar, they said. That's what they say. Amazon's crazy. They don't know what they're talking about. Their fucking shipping's all out of whack right now. It is so crazy. I got a script yesterday that said it'd be here on June 8th. Oh my god. Okay. So I got my little nephew these backhoe and stuff. Oh yeah? They're supposed to be like this big. Yeah, yeah. They're almost half his size. <laughs> They're only 80 bucks. Yeah. If I'd have had this, like, this shit, that shit when I was a kid, that would have been 400 bucks a piece. Easy. 500 bucks a piece. Yeah, because it was really something very custom back then. Oh, no, I mean, yeah, it was one of those like yeah, you definitely. But they've come so long, far and shit nowadays. It's like, well, like you said, hey, I didn't think he liked it that much. Yeah, he's kind of obsessed with it. I'm glad. <laughs> so he's, he's kind of obsessed with it. Look at him. That's the other statement, man. He's kind of. He's on it. He hasn't gotten off of it since he's been on it. This, I'm so excited. Now he's looking to see what else is going on. Look at him. He says, what the hell? These people have all kinds of toys. <laughs> What's new? We love to spoil the babies. Mm -hmm. He loves himself some tunnels. So, yeah. Let me see how this is going to work out. Oh, damn. Didn't know it was all She's just staring at you. Yeah, she freaked out too. Yeah. But when I brought her in, it was like, as I'm bringing her in, MJ's just standing at the door like she always does. And I get over MJ and she goes, Whoosh. Really? Yeah, and just like, nope, I want out. And <laughs> jumped from the hand to here. And then as soon as she hit, she went, She, Boop. she will literally no point shit. herself in any direction. Yeah, she don't like being carried. Him, on the she other hand, you don't mind. You don't mind it. But she hates it, so that's supposed to be the centerpiece. Yeah. Well, Rudy has left the building. Well, obviously you haven't yet. This is what we're talking about, by the way. Little fish. 
Oh yeah, because people probably don't know what the hell are you talking about. 